I, I don't know. I think we are battling happiness right now. I'm the most happiest girl in, in the world right now. You know, as soon as I got this uh, flyer, I told myself, oh, God, God, this is huge. I'm blessed to have this. Ah, God, I don't, know what to say. I don't want to get emotional. I'm so happy. I just love it right here. It's okay. Um, it's okay. <laughs> I, 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 I got to know um, this woman when I was little. Hmm. She has not changed, though. <laughs> I think... Oh, I'm missing. <laughs> You've not changed, though. <laughs> Please, what's your secret? I, I don't know, but I think it's... Um, I'm taking care of myself very well, and there are some food I don't eat anymore. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of too much of um, meat, mm -hmm. and keeping myself very well. That's wow. It. Wow. Yeah, I thought maybe you have something to say by the grace of God, though, because, you know, no, usually no, no, people no, say it's that. It's not everything that a God has to do. <laughs> How we make him God a magician? Mm. No, 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 no. No, it's, it's, it's you, like, taking care of yourself, okay. uh, like, at least keeping fit mm -hmm. and all that. It's very, very important. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but, but, but do you uh, kind of like it sometimes when uh, they kind of compare you to the youth? Really? Yeah. Then that's good. Yeah. We need that. I said, I said, in chronic, of course. Probably it's because of my figure, okay. how God, wow. I like, I, I'm, I'm, I'm cool. Yeah. Very. Wow. Okay. Let's put it down. Let's get to business right now. Okay. I, I, know, I know you to, you used to teach. Mm -hmm. Um. You've been in the industry since uh, 2004. That's a long time. Exactly. How did you shift from te uh, teaching mm -hmm. right to music? Okay, I think somewhere 2006. Mm -hmm. um, and seven there, but I think it was December. Mm -hmm. um, I realized that I'm not always in the classroom. Mm -hmm. And I have to be traveling yeah. outside Ghana and not leaving the classroom. Mm -hmm. It was very, very... Uh, a big problem for me so I sat down with my headmistress and I, I told her I, I need to move with this one because this is more demanding mm. and I feel leaving the classroom and leaving the kids it's very very um, a big problem for mm. me so I, I went to the Ghana um, education service and then I have to defer mm. from teaching wow. for some time mm. but even whilst I'm home mm -hmm. I'm teaching I have a lot of up and coming artists that come to me okay. for advice. It's more or less like being in a classroom. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so always a teacher. Forever a teacher. <laughs> There's no changing. <laughs> no. Okay, so um, the journey of uh, transition from teaching to music, how was mm. the journey like? Was it a tough one? It wasn't mm. because I've, I've been like in music whilst I was at the age of, I think, 15 years. Yeah, singing in the Church of Pentacles. Mm. Like when I was at the secondary school, mm. I was the SU president, okay. um, Golden Bells president, one of the biggest um, mm. uh, music group uh, then, mm -hmm. somewhere to 1996 okay. at Ghana's. Okay. Yeah. Yes, so I, I've been in music mm. for a long time, wow. and God has taken me through a lot of process mm. to to understand a lot of things when it comes to stagecraft mm -hmm. and a whole lot mm -hmm. and then to take up my own calling as a gospel music wow. okay i guess it. but but wasn't it tough for you because um i think growing up you had it in mind that that's mm -hmm. why that you, you were doing the singing and everything mm -hmm. you went to school to become a teacher and all mm -hmm. that so putting that aside wasn't it breaking your heart in a way it was mm -hmm. but what um i, I think those times leaving the classroom i was praying and the lord said there's a bigger picture mm. in what i've called you into mm. and there are a lot of souls that are looking up to you wow. and you are not just leaving the classroom mm. but there's going to be another mm -hmm. um way of teaching mm -hmm. and i i now understand mm. why god was saying that wow. yeah. okay so write in your first song do you remember your first song yes can you sing it about it? Si abu ta chen no ai, si abu ta chen no ati. Onya min chen e bo shen, se di ani pa chen e se chen no. Did you know that song will become a hit? <laughs> it has. But did you know? 
No. Uh, but out of experience, I remember writing this song. I was in the classroom. I was owing uh, one of one person that came to the classroom and was shouting on top, <laughs> on top of, of her voice, and it was. It was very, very pathetic. So I have to cry, move out of the classroom with her, go outside and mm -hmm. beg her. Whilst I was going, one of my shoes got torn. I have to carry her. I even forgot myself. I was begging her and one person came around and begged her and she said, mm -hmm. she's just giving me some time mm -hmm. to come and pay. So I came back to the classroom. I was crying mm -hmm. and I can't even control myself. Oh, and wow. then... While I was writing on the board, the Lord gave me a message that Siabote Tremi, Namir Radimin Cherimi Boshe, who said, Yeah, Nipa Jenny said, Echen, whatever you are going to, very soon I will take you out. Wow. So anytime I get the message, I write it down. Mm -hmm. So when I was ready to go to the studio, this is the only message I was going to the studio with, like a single song. Wow. I was supposed to come out with 10 songs. Mm -hmm. So when I got to Nasi and I was talking to him about the song, he, he asked me, what song do you have? And I, I only have words. I gave it to Nasi and said, I'm going to help you. Mm -hmm. Now, we started, we used, I think, three days to produce all the songs. Mm -hmm. Anytime I will go back, mm -hmm. I'll have a message mm -hmm. the night. Madi Mehu, for instance, I think I was in a car while after studio, mm -hmm. I was in a car and a, and a gentleman who came around and was asking for money. Mm -hmm. And I, when I look at the, the guy, I, it reflected to two of my brothers that died mysteriously. So I was talking to him and I gave him the money and whilst I w the car moved, I was crying and the Lord spoke to me, Majo. What do you if we put you So I was thinking about it. So when I got to the studio, I said, Nasi, my demon, if you're going to send me more than then right there. So there's so much mysterious way God gives me messages, and it's, it's amazing. Wow. Yes. Wow. Well, would you say um, uh, how you write your songs is quite easy for you? That's why that it comes to a message. It's not. It? Okay. It's not. Mm. Some of the messages, uh, sometimes if when a man of God is preaching, mm -hmm. it will drop into my spirit. When somebody's, mm -hmm. like we are talking mm -hmm. like this, mm -hmm. some messages can drop into mm -hmm. my spirit. When somebody's sharing a, t a mm -hmm. testimony or experience, what they've gone through with me. Uh, so there's a different, different way, but it's not that easy. I have to pray when the message comes. I have to pray, go into the word of mm -hmm. God and for God to direct me as wow. to how to form the wow. songs. Yeah. 2004 to date, we've seen people come and go. We've seen people, you know, do a whole lot within a short period of time. You're still here. How? Why? What do you do? To get here is the man out there. I, I, I don't know how he, he is doing it. I don't know how I was able to survive up to now, mm -hmm. but to God be the glory. Okay. It has not been easy mm -hmm. at all. But you see, it is time and season mm -hmm. when your time is come up, and God is the one that is taking you on his wings, mm -hmm. flying with you to your destination. You are sure. Mm -hmm. Of, of a prosperous mm -hmm. end. And mm -hmm. I know there are bigger, bigger pictures ahead of me. Mm -hmm. And I'm prepared for it. Okay, that's amazing. <laughs> that's super right there. Uh, looking at uh, the gospel tunes that is coming uh, mm -hmm. up now, there are so many dynamics to it. Okay. There are so many changes. Mm -hmm. They've added, they've taken out. Uh, it's just a whole lot. Mm -hmm. Do you kind of think uh, the way things are going are okay? It's amazing. Mm -hmm. And for me, God is not a one way God. Mm -hmm. He moves with time mm -hmm. and seasons and whatever mm -hmm. is going, mm -hmm. he, he, he works with mm -hmm. it. And for me, I believe that God wants to reach out to lots of souls. Mm -hmm. So however he will, mm -hmm. through tunes, mm -hmm. whatever mm -hmm. tunes, like, messages can, mm -hmm. can move, mm -hmm. he will. Okay. So God gives wisdom to the studio, mm -hmm. um, what do you call it? the producers, mm -hmm. to come up with powerful tunes. Mm -hmm. And for us, we are mm -hmm. ready for everything. Mm 
Mm. And now, by the grace of God, we have the chance mm. that's also coming on, mm. coming in mm. into the gospel mm. music. Okay. And it's part of it. Okay, but looking at um, your time mm -hmm. and coming up and everything, it, it seems <laughs> you guys were spirit filled. Sanayo. Uh, kind of. Let's, let's be truthful. It is. <laughs> spirit filled. Like, Mommy, when you open your mouth right now, mm. and when, let's be truthful, we compare to the right now people, what's the difference? Hey, what you need? Sir. For me, I believe that anything new, mm -hmm. it takes time okay. for people to understand. Okay. I, I have seen God revealing to me mm -hmm. the eagles and the seasons and things that he's about to do with the young mm. men and women mm -hmm. and we need to get ready mm -hmm. for another move mm -hmm. for me i will be very glad to see a lot of eagles coming in on to hold on to the mantle and to run with mm -hmm. it in as much as we have some one or two nuts in in and it, it is everywhere mm -hmm. you can't put it all together mm -hmm. but for me mm -hmm. And the likes of Ikfi Grace, uh, Kofi Bipra, mm -hmm. um, lot of eagles that yeah. God is bringing. Mm -hmm. I am happy about mm -hmm. them. Mm -hmm. And for me, I'm proud. So you, you kind of contradict to what Ghanaians are saying. Say, mm, the gospel teams are not there. I, say, Deb, Deb, Holy Ghost okay. said that I remember coming up mm -hmm. with... Um, Ma de me ho e from mm -hmm. That was uh, like the tune was actually being used by most of the hip mm -hmm. life mm -hmm. artists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Nasi has to use it mm -hmm. and it was very very controversial mm -hmm. but now it's one of the tunes that mm -hmm. everyone is mm -hmm. using so anything new mm -hmm. seems mm -hmm. like questionable mm -hmm. but okay. for time they will understand so, you, so i see nothing wrong so you advise Ghanaians to take their time they'll get used to it of course <laughs> Okay, so um, there have been so uh, many narratives uh, out there that um, gospel artists don't practice what they preach. Mm. Um, some are saying, hey, gospel artists, you are high. When you get closer to them, what the pepper that he or she will show you on mobile house, that they are different people all together. Mm. Uh, some say, say, hey, Obi or her, or you are a new man. Oh, they are question be mm. There has been so many narratives. Have you heard some? Even in the churches there. Okay. Baby, be a young couple, see that could be a bonzamo. So these things mm -hmm. are things to distract okay. gospel music. Okay. But the truth is that God mm -hmm. knows His own. Mm -hmm. And He's working with His own. Okay. Yes, I cannot um, debunk the fact that um, sometimes you mm -hmm. have one or two. Mm -hmm. Uh, people that really don't understand their calling and mm -hmm. they are just doing anything mm -hmm. but it doesn't mean that it is all okay. so for me yes it can be possible but i don't believe it okay yeah uh, but uh <laughs> wait, don't you kind of feel that humans are humans uh one way or the other there will be some sort of uh, truth somewhere that's what i'm saying that okay. I, I for me i don't believe it but okay. it can be true okay yeah because um Maybe I nyami will be up on some so oh. yeah. True. Um, I see that you hold a prayer section um, <laughs> <laughs> on six o'clock. Me, you know. But don't you pray in your room? I do. Yes, that's what I do. So, so can I dub you as a prophetess now? <laughs> no, I don't. Know. I I am not ready for that. It's a big mantle. But, but I'm doing what. I always do when I was a baby, okay. like a baby, in the in the secondary but school. But it, it seems it's new to people now. It's not new. Okay. But like I think I, when I entered into the gospel music, mm -hmm. I now at least I think somewhere mm -hmm. 2011, okay. where I I, I got in, onto the mm -hmm. Facebook, mm -hmm. I was the first gospel musicians, okay. and in fact, a woman mm -hmm. that came on the Facebook to preach. Mm -hmm. And it was, it is a medium, mm -hmm. most especially on the social media mm -hmm. platform, to preach okay. and share the word of God, okay. encourage people. That's actually what I I'm do. Whilst I was at the secondary okay. school, okay. I'm still doing it. So it's not different. 
<laughs> but, but, but the comments, but the comments that is coming from people, uh, when did... It's just the testimonies, probably, people are sharing okay. that makes it feel like, mm. but I mean, call Bible school. Okay. Mm, you know, so you that, that mantle is big. <laughs> you are not a prophet. <laughs> I am a gospel musician. <laughs> okay, so talking about uh, your relationship, mm -hmm. you have a very beautiful relationship with Sissy Chu. Yes. She's my mommy at attend her church. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've seen you there several times. That's, so, that's why I'm so happy to have that's you here. That's my blood. Yes. How would you describe her and how would you describe your relationship with her? She's sweet, mm -hmm. very caring. And for me, she has a sweet spirit. Mm -hmm. I remember my first time coming into the gospel music, one powerful man of God. That mm -hmm. he, the husband is the first man of God that actually invited me to Accra. Mm -hmm. So that was where we built mm -hmm. that relationship. Okay. Since I, I, got, I, I came out with my first album. Mm -hmm. So we've been friends for 20 years. Yes. Ah, so it's not recent? No. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> it's not it's not recent for a long time. It's not recent. Just that people do not see us yes. moving, but we talk a lot, okay. we share ideas a okay. lot, we we have a tight relationship. Okay. Yes. okay. So talking about your friendship and all that, <laughs> we rarely see female to female collaboration mm -hmm. but the gospel tunes so it's like for me i've been in a relationship with Sissy mm -hmm. it's recently that you've seen us okay. one or two okay. yeah so it, it's it's there are some relationships you don't put out there okay we are very cool with each other okay. and if you be a man's a woman <laughs> <laughs> but the truth is mm -hmm. that we are very cool. Okay. We pray with each other. Mm -hmm. We share. Mm -hmm. We share a lot mm -hmm. with each other. Mm -hmm. We love each other. Mm -hmm. Yes. So uh, uh, apart from you know the relationship and everything, <laughs> but I, we have to see more of and the features. Eh, uh, basso. Maybe oh, as it's too near, you know. Yeah, we do. PSCN I think. And, I think. I think. I. I think very soon we'll be having a lot. But I've done with Lady Prempe. Uh -huh. And one or two mm. gospel musicians. Mm -hmm. yes. So why is it not frequent? Okay. Yes. Okay. That's what I can see. Okay. Yes. So so God gives the direction. Probably. You just can't do anything mm -hmm. on your own. Um, has there been a point whereby um so I say a worldly mm -hmm. artist has come to you for you guys to work Maria before? Mo. That's how we call them. <laughs> Since you are gospel, worldly. Eh? That's what we call them. Since you're a gospel artist, you are classified as godly. Oh, so, that. as the OBO opposite, listen, these people have lots of relations. They have tight relationship with the Lord. Mm -hmm. Some of these artists mm -hmm. have their fathers and, mm -hmm. and mothers are in the church. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. some of, of them are even mm -hmm. men of God. Mm -hmm. So, you can never, like, judge anyone. Mm -hmm. Some even have very tight relationship mm -hmm. with the Lord. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, it's the truth. Somebody like Kwabna Kwabna, mm -hmm. he, when you get close to him, you get to know that there's, there's, there's a different side of him mm -hmm. when it comes mm -hmm. to the things mm -hmm. of God. Mm -hmm. So for me, I can't take them into the dustbin. No, but Auntie, Kwabna Kwabna is, uh, he might be Christocentric and all that, but <laughs> the song he put out, <laughs> Is that for me? <laughs> Anytime I get to mm -hmm. close to Kwabna Kwabna, this is the argument we have mm. that I see a calling on him. Mm. No, see, Oima, I can't just come out just to take this mantle because I understand mm -hmm. where that mm -hmm. calling is mm -hmm. from. But when I'm ready, mm -hmm. probably when God gives me the green light, mm -hmm. I will do that. Mm -hmm. But the truth is that Kwabna Kwabna has the heart mm -hmm. of God. Okay. Anything can happen. <laughs> Lord Kenya is even a pastor now. So. Some of these songs are mm -hmm. put marriages together mm -hmm. and all that. So mm -hmm. you can't actually judge that. Okay. And we are on punk, we come. So you can't actually judge that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Okay.
Yeah, well. Mm -hmm. But is that when those features do come, mm -hmm. they talk? Why? Ghanaians do talk. They complain. You, you see, we we coming from a society where we have classified, we have put gospel music mm. and the worldly and the understanding mm. is mm. not there. Mm. And the truth is mm. that when I do, I'm ready to do a gospel music with, let's say, any hip life artist. Mm. I want to, my, my, my music need to pull the person okay. into okay. the mm. Lord. You understand? Mm. What if I am done mm -hmm. doing a gospel music with the mm. person, a person goes back? That's the question. Mm. You understand? Yeah. So there has to be a change. Mm. When I see that a person is ready okay. to, to come into our side, mm. then I have that free mind. Okay. Because the understanding of gospel music mm. and hip life artists is, is different Altogether. in our religion, mm. especially in our Christian mm. religion. So do you, you, you're not supposed to joke with that. Okay. Okay. I, I get it. Because in an interview, Joe Metto mentioned that he wouldn't do it. And of course. Okay. That's the truth. Okay. If I can't get them into mm -hmm. my kingdom, mm -hmm. then there is no way doing it. Mm -hmm. okay. so, so talking about um, concerts, performances, mm -hmm. and all that, mm -hmm. let's take it for example. Mm -hmm. Someone like Shatawali calls mm -hmm. you, oh, hey, mama, is this your song? It hits here. <laughs> there's bikes there. So please, can I add you to mine? Do you know I love Shatawali so much? Mm -hmm. The reason is, is, is his, he has some kind of energy, energy and you, you can't take Shakta Wally mm -hmm. out of everything, mm. you understand? Mm. He has built his own empire. Mm -hmm. And for me, mm -hmm. I remember when he, he came out with this song, um, I know my level. Mm. <laughs> I preached with it oh. because if you know your level mm -hmm. in the Lord, mm -hmm. nobody can bring you down. Sure. So he he has some kind of songs mm -hmm. that he he put out there mm -hmm. that encourages mm -hmm. a lot. Mm -hmm. And for me, he comes out with songs that speaks to your soul okay. and to give you that mm -hmm. kind of edge to mm -hmm. move on. So for me, Shatawale now said, if he calls you for a concert, would you go? For me, where I am standing, it will be very difficult. Even though I admire him so much. Because baby, I'm a Gina. Who was it? Baby, I'm a Gina. Baby, I'm a Gina. A bad thing. Yes, it ain't everything. God first. In the baby, I saw the start. To back us, I mean, Drew, one mommy could preach here, be an asshole back over. It's yes, God first. To be a winner, do over chassis. Oh, boy. Hey. Oh boy. On the 8th of September, Tahila Experience is coming on. And the whole page that is. It's coming on, oh, it's coming on. I will be there. You see, no. If, no matter the concept, no matter the money. Mm, no, you can't. Let me say, if, let me say, if he offers you triple of what you usually charge. But nobody, everybody knows that nobody can buy on him a mess with money. Sure. For that, mm. if it is God that is telling me to go, I will go. If not, no. Mm, but the, there are some colleagues of yours that have performed there. Of course, it's it's individual understanding okay. of their okay. calling. Okay. Yes. Mm. Okay. Oh, that's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's let's get back into a little personal life of yours. Um, your marriage. Okay. Uh huh. Beautiful. A whole lot came up and everything. Okay. Uh, okay. It got to me a little bit. Mm -hmm. Do you feel uh, for the fact that you mixed work with mm -hmm. marriage? Mm -hmm. That's why it brought everything down. No, I think it's something that I actually don't want to go into so much into it. But mm -hmm. um, we understand each other, mm -hmm. and we feel at this particular time mm -hmm. it's going to affects my ministry is okay. going to affect him and that we need to separate okay. and so there was that mutual understanding mm. uh, between the two of us okay. but now 
we help each other okay. when he calls me to get any idea I share with him mm -hmm. and if when it comes into my ministry mm -hmm. because you know that I've worked with him for a long time when it's coming to my ministry last year he was around yeah. when we we're doing so we have that beautiful mm -hmm. relationship but it is the married that did not work mm -hmm. so we are cool oh that's nice <laughs> you pleaded for the mentality uh, not to you know be sealed or mm -hmm. put on any legal terms mm -hmm. why they have beautiful future yeah they carry something that I see mm -hmm. ahead of them mm -hmm. that God mm -hmm. is going to take mm -hmm. them far. Mm -hmm. And for me, when I get that revelation, mm -hmm. I will fight for it. Mm -hmm. I will fight for anyone. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. when you come around me, mm -hmm. I'm one person that will always fight for mm -hmm. up and coming artists mm -hmm. to stand because <laughs> yeah. there's coming a time some of us we cannot go anywhere. Yeah. We need these eagles move, to mm -hmm. move. W w with the word okay. so for me um even if i have to carry them on my head to move and to that, that means you, you love them that I much love them. wow i love them so much wow. i love them wow yes wow. okay so what was this a uh, spectacular thing about them that you kind of like is this a vibrancy or yes number one mm -hmm. and i see the uniqueness about their music mm. and the lady mm -hmm. that is even mm -hmm. leading them, mm -hmm. I see fire in mm -hmm. her. Okay. The genuineness mm -hmm. and their mind on what they are doing. Mm -hmm. And they carry power to mm -hmm. it. So for me, I mean for that. But I saw one comment that kind of said that uh, you are condoning something. I know. So as yes, yes. Yeah, say, I saw say, No, no, mm -hmm. listen. I, I also made a comment mm -hmm. that uh, the fact that I was begging mm -hmm. doesn't mean that mm -hmm what Kwame is doing is wrong okay. because when it comes to copyright mm -hmm. when you inflict on mm -hmm. it the, the 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 law will, will, will get you, yes yeah. so Kwame is right to to go after them mm -hmm. but I'm pleading that at least they've learned <laughs> their lessons mm -hmm. so if, if there's going to be a way of sitting down mm -hmm. and to talk about it amicably mm -hmm. it's it's really good mm -hmm. and by the grace of god they've done it yes yes yes, yes. I, I think so my, my pleading yeah it, really it worked <laughs> it worked so would that be a feature because you want to flash them oh i wish and i'm praying it will come on it's been short it will please <laughs> we are waiting for it <laughs> I I will. Up on a, uh, a chop party near me. Nasir has also pleaded on behalf of Seth Smith. Are you also going to plead that? that? Um, you see our mercy seat or her day. Jesus Christ. But uh, it's to the beer. Mm -hmm. Let's earn a truth. Mm -hmm. I stand for the truth mm -hmm. and I'm a role model mm -hmm. because the generation that we are in now, it seems like we are joking with everything. Mm -hmm. So if the law needs to take its own mm -hmm. course, it has to be so that it will be like a caution mm -hmm. to anyone that would just get up mm -hmm. and play with the minds of people. Mm -hmm. For me, I, I, mm -hmm. don't, I don't go with it. But people, I kind of say he 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 did it in the right way. If it kind of worked for him, and got so yeah. In Tinka, you won't go out with any member. We couldn't have met him in two hundred years, sir. Now, go out with him. We couldn't say two hundred years. But to deceive people, Papa Kofi drew crab. Beka said no, mm -hmm. is is wrong. Mm -hmm. You understand. Mm -hmm. But in, in as much as we have to punish him, mm -hmm. I think Yenche na 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 ni suna wosu. And yeah, you need money chance now. Also, on your side, I think we should forgive him. Yeah, you're just a wonderful person. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 20 years <laughs> oh, in the industry, new projects coming up. Yes, what's new with you? Tell us all. Get ready for a lot of surprises next wow. year because we're going to have a lot of books from Ohima Messi's camp. Uh, we're going to have a powerful documentary a whole video mm. of him is going to be like a, a movie wow. from
from or him and Messi right from when I was a child mm. growing in Koforidia and coming out with my first album into the industry and all that we actually working on it mm -hmm. seriously mm -hmm. and then we also coming up with a um, lot of surprises from some of the artists that are going to mm -hmm. sing mm -hmm. personalize some of my songs mm -hmm. and we're going to release it so next year is, is so packed mm. uh, apart from that this year we we have released um, Dry Bones, Dry Bones. and it is really, them. really doing very well. Wherever you are, just go to the YouTube and all the digital platforms. Mm. Just mm. download Dry Bones. Mm. And I think we have to check it out. Of course. Please, let's go watch you. <laughs> you know, you go see.